and this is your next video. For this one, you'll need a strap. If you don't have a strap, you can use an old tie or you can use a towel or you can use the elastic band as well if you wanted to. And you'll need also the small weights, the small yellow hand weights that you have. So we'll start in the seated position. I really want to work on a little bit of stretching for you. So we'll start with both feet flat, sitting tall. Just take a few deep breaths in and out through your nose. And when you're ready, cross right thigh over left. So thigh over thigh. We'll go into a little bit of a twist. So the right hand comes beside you and the left hand just presses. So you get a nice stretch. Keep the torso nice and long. See if you can look over the right shoulder. Just a few more breaths. And then release and look forward. We'll switch it up. So this time cross left thigh over right. Right hand comes on the thigh, left hand beside you. Take a deep breath. Twist and look over the left shoulder. Nice full breaths. And then release and look forward. You'll get a hold of the strap or the tie or something long that you can use. And I'll invite you to slip that underneath the right foot only. You'll extend the right leg out. So you're supporting your leg up by pulling on both sides of the strap or the thigh. So on this one, we'll draw the knee in towards your chest and out. Doing this 10 times. going. Let's do five more. Really press against once you extend the leg out. We have the last two on this leg. And press. Okay, switch it up. Get your strap underneath the left foot this time, extending the leg all the way out to start. And then drawing the knee in as close. So use your upper body as well to pull it in closer. Get those elbows wide. We get eight to go. Three more, last two, and one. There, let's drop the, the uh, strap down, get a hold of your weight. We'll work on the shoulder press now. So lift the elbows up at 90 degrees. See if you can press them straight up and then come back to 90. Very good. Five to go. Five, four, three. Make sure that you don't dip too low here. Stay at 90. We've got last one. And then drop the arms to your side. See if you can hold it. You may want to add a little pulse or just stay still. Stay as long as you can. Deep breaths in. Try to keep those arms shoulders light, shoulder height as long as you can. And drop them. Good job, let's stand up. So we'll stand straight up in front of the chair. And then I want you with control to sit back, but don't quite land on the chair. I want you to hold just above the chair. Take a few big breaths and sit down. And again, deep breath, rise up, press your pelvis forward. So that means squeeze the glutes and then slowly sit down. Just hover over the seat as close to the seat as you can. And down. Three more of these. Deep breath. Rise up. Squeeze it in and then sit down. Just hovering. Not touching. I know it's tempting. And sit. Almost there. Stand up. Sit back. Really back. Make sure that you can still see your toes so your weight is right back. And sit. Last time. All the way up. Hover. And stand back up. We'll do a balancing posture here. You can use the back of the chair if you need to press uh, your hand for balance. Right knee lifts up. Imagine that you are tracing the infinity sign with your knee. So almost like an eight sideways. So see how the hip 
is moving, like the femur bone is moving into the hip socket. Try to make that infinity sign as large as you can. Pay attention to which direction you're going and then switch it up. <laughs> Try to trace it in the opposite direction. Keep that knee high. Almost there. There you go. Drop it down. Shake it up a little bit. Other side, again, the chair is optional. It's there for your stability as needed. No left knee this time. Right up. Tracing an eight. Lift that knee up. Trace with control. Notice which direction you're going. Switch it up. Very good. And down. Let's take a big breath. Sweep your arms up. Exhale through your mouth. Make some noise. One more time. Deep breath. This time we'll forward fold. So bend at your hip. Allow the head to be heavy. The knees are soft. Shake your head a little bit from side to side. Place your hands on your shins and look ahead. Halfway lift. Exhale and let go. Deep breath, sweep all the way up, hands together, heart center. I'd like you to do this video as often as you can. If you can fit it in daily, that would be ideal. A little bit of fitness, go for it.